I'm going to show you how to test a few different types of fuses now. Uh, they all work on the same principle basically and it's a deliberate weak link in a circuit. Uh, if something does go wrong with that circuit the fuse will burn out rather than causing damage to the circuit that it's protecting hopefully. Uh, these are small fuses that you'd find in any kind of appliance. That's a 5 amp one that you'd normally find on a, a light and that's a 3 amp one that's off something that uses uh, even less electricity and then we've got something there that's more like industrial that's a 20 amp cartridge fuse and then there we've got a 30 amp fuse that you'd find uh, probably protecting uh, a ring main so to test the fuses you don't need anything technical really you can use something as cheap as this that's a 99p electrical screwdriver uh, it's not a neon screwdriver, don't confuse it with a neon I'm not uh, a fan of neon screwdrivers, I, I don't like them at all and uh, I, I wouldn't suggest that anybody uses a neon but th this one's pretty unique because rather than using it for electrical testing you, you can actually use it a couple of different ways, if you hold it by the tip there and put it near something that is live it actually illuminates in there telling you that it's live so you're not actually touching the thing that's live so it's like a non-contact voltage detector really also if you make a circuit with through your body it illuminates so for, for 99p really you've got a, a circuit tester that you can uh, use on a few things one of which is a fuse so if you get a fuse and hold it by the end and then touch your tip onto there if the fuse is working it will light up like that's doing so you know that that fuse is working exactly the same with that one that lights up as well and same with the bigger fuses so that, that tells you that all of the fuses are ok another way to check is with a, a multimeter like that one and with one of these you need to use a pair of leads so plug the red lead into the V side and the black lead into the COM and then if you take a look at it you'll see that it measures ohms which is resistance and also some of them have a, a bleep feature on which is there which is the sign with the speaker on it so now if we touch the two probes together the uh, tester will emit a beep every time we touch them together so testing a, a fuse with this is also very simple just touch it on one side and then on the other and when you get a bleep like that you know that the fuse is okay